I had a long day in the knitting studio. Seven hours of a lot of trial and error and error and error and error. I did kind of accomplish a little bit. I'm looking for something new to watch on Netflix right now just so I can have a little break. And finally, I am I'm going to start the office. You've come to the master for guidance. <laughs> Is this what you're saying, Grasshopper? Uh, actually, you called me in here. It's been, it's been a long day. I mean, everything's good. I know my hair is not. I had my headband on all day. So, my bangs just stay up. I share Tyler's Netflix, the one that his family has. So, I think you can guess which one's our account. So, I tell you that I'm going to brush my teeth and this is what you do? You take my spot? She's getting ready for bed too. But I guess I'm gonna have to sleep on the other side tonight. Do you give up your spot for your cat? I know I'm not the only one. So I guess she's gonna get the warm fleece blanket that I rely on, but you know, it's cause she knows it's warm. Not so sleepy now, are we? Thank you. It's been kind of a chill morning. I was knitting and reading at the same time. Oh, that's like a baby. <laughs> I have myself this long scarf already, by the way. I used the entire yarn that I thrifted last year. Multicolored yarn! Basically, I've been meaning to buy yarn. Oh, here it is. It looks quite interesting from afar because you can see it's regular and then it seems to change right about here. Maybe I missed a stitch and the whole thing just changed. I have no idea. I mentioned last time that I ordered a bunch of books. Four of them have already come in. One of them has really slow shipping, which is fine because I have so many anyway in the meantime. I decided that I'm not going to unpackage all of these books at once. I'm going to pick one. This shall be my next novel. Chosen at random. Voila. I just said voila. <laughs> voila. <laughs> this shall be the next novel I read. They both die at the end. Everything that I got so far is still recommended on that list that I made. And if you want to refer to it, it's a story highlight on my page. So you can also read along with me. I have got it made in the shade. I know this company. The other branch managers are total morons. Hey, Pam. Yeah, I forgot what day the interview was. I drove to New York accidentally. Tuesdays are always long for me. I came home, chilled with my sister for a little bit. She's busy trying to make her business card right now. And I'm gonna have dinner with my friend Lana. I'm about to get picked up. I'm just wearing tan pants and this vintage sweater that I recently acquired. This is the box that the sweater came in, in the mail. And Prairie just loves to sit in garbage-like things. <laughs> she loves to sit in bags, she loves to sit in boxes. She was playing with the mouse. Just so cute. And this was closed, by the way. She opened the box and she got in. I'm back now from our weaving session and I am going to run errands now. Hi 
just did a sit down video. Technically I filmed two this morning. I wanted to do a makeup routine. I forgot to film the audio. Now I only have a little bit of time to eat lunch before I head off to class for five hours. for your dinner, Prairie? I'm ready for mine. This is horrendous because I have a lot of machine technical difficulties. I happen to get one of the unlucky machines. So instead of getting to bind off the proper way, I'm just gonna attempt to hand, hand bind this. When I went grocery shopping the other day, I picked up Greek yogurt, but this time it's plain. I've always had the key lime flavor, which is very sweet and has a lot of added sugars, but I've been trying to just eat healthier in general. Thankfully, the granola and my oats have a little bit of added sugar. The yogurt, I'm always like trying. I'm just dealing with it because if you have any ideas for what I can do, I would love to hear them, but just know that I don't like honey and I don't like fruit. And that's like the, what I see everyone put in their yogurt. The more I have it, the more I'll be used to not needing so much sugar in the yogurt. <sighs> it's so hard to focus this morning. Do you ever put your pen here? Cause it helps you feel like you're reading. Yeah. I made some sundubu for lunch, which is Korean soft tofu stew. And I put noodles in it because I don't have enough rice. Then there's some bell peppers, mushrooms. I kind of just put in what I had. Cracked an egg on top and that's, that's good to go. I'm so bundled up because I rented the bike and I got some packages from Murad. So thank you so much. I have no idea how. This was sent to me because I'm not sure who <laughs> comes with a cotton blend pillowcase for easy travel. 
Wow, and really random. <laughs> Thank you, Casper. So I believe that Murad was doing a collaboration with them because I got, I don't know where I put it, I got a serum. <laughs> so in this box, we have a cleanser and a multi-mist, which I'm guessing is um, a toner. bagel this morning and I normally just eat half because I go to exercise and I come back and eat again and I, I see this dark spot on it and I'm like what is that and I'm confused because I just bought these bagels and they should be good for a while so I was in disbelief I was like I can't believe there's mold on my bagel but it was just like a teeny bit too colorful in a way so i go in my sister's room and I wake her up and i'm like is this mold or is this a blueberry <laughs> so there was a stray blueberry that somehow got into my wheat bagel and i would know that if i eat fruit but i don't i just picked it out it concerns a lot of people when they find out i don't eat fruit what i lack in fruit i completely make up in vegetables because vegetables are my favorite food i love kale i love collard greens spinach Asparagus. Most people do not enjoy that, but I can have plain vegetables that's steamed with no salt. Back then, do you remember my broccoli and sriracha days? My Glossier package came in last night, right? So who knew this morning it would take three hours to film, prep, and just everything. So now, 10 minutes until my class, packed quick lunch, and I'm gonna leave for five hours and come home and edit. <laughs> I like my outfit today. It's very colorful. I finally finished editing and publishing my Glossier Play Try On unboxing. But this morning I tried on a different eyeliner, so it's very colorful. Oh, and Tyler's here. <laughs> Hi. I like the eyeliner. It's so nice. He's wearing my duck sweater. Yes, it fits like a club. Well, I think it is for men. Yeah, yeah. It's nice that we can share clothes. I never expected to say that about my girlfriend. Yeah. Man, I was so lucky that we got that spot. Is someone leaving? Do you want to crack the window? Yeah, maybe a good idea. My cake. We're having it in the car because it's loud and crowded inside. Mm. And we get a view of the highway. Yep, yep. And it's private and warm in here. 
Yeah. I mean, on top of the highway, you can see the city too, so. What city? <laughs> I should have asked them to heat up the cake. Oh no. It's still pretty good. We're leaving for dinner now. Wearing something fancy for no particular reason. Because I want to. Oh my gosh. She's wearing all black, which is not out of the ordinary at all. your head. March, but you still have 10 months. <laughs> and they're all specialty flavors. It's strawberry, grapefruit. Thank you for making this more. I had to head out. We didn't have any more honey, so it's peanut butter? Peanut butter and the chocolate hazelnut thing. Oh, okay. This is a very impromptu. Is this a rubber band? Oh, oh. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear Kira. Happy birthday to you. Make a wish. have completely adjusted to Greek yogurt. So I kind of take back what I said earlier before about, you know, not knowing if I can eat it plain, but now it actually tastes kind of good. Today was my longest day. Came back from eight hours of class and for the rest of the night, I will just brainstorm, do some homework. But before I get to all of that, I really want to spend some time alone and just paint and think. My anxiety has been a little higher in the last two weeks for I think healthy reasons, you know, feeling challenged in school and challenging myself and my work. So at least for the rest of the day, I am taking a little bit of a retreat. I'm so dead from the workout this morning. It's been about five days since I actually had a proper workout because during the weekend with Tyler over and everything, all of my plans got switched up. I ordered these new vitamins that came in. Some things have changed in the last couple of weeks in this vlog, you know? I got better at knitting because I remember near the beginning I was like close to tears. I have grown to love Greek yogurt, <laughs> plain without anything in it. And I started the office and now, I am on season six of The Office. <laughs> Just so many things. I don't know why I'm so excited right now. Every time I work out, I get like a lot of endorphins and I'm like all happy for the rest of the day. Anyways, I just wanted to update that. I had a great time painting last night and I ended up recording some of the process, but it's not as involved or as thought out as the other ones that you're familiar with. So I as I was saying, oh, this is also a dead battle. As I was saying, 
I can remember. I tend to have really high standards and I normally would say like, okay, if I'm not gonna do a video with all of all of my energy and try to make it good, as good as possible, then I shouldn't do it. But I ended up recording the process because I thought that it's better than nothing and I should ease back into making more art related videos. The reason why I don't is one, because I just haven't been as creative and as I guess free when it comes to making art for the sake of that I just thought that you know with my busy schedule I only had my scraps of energy to apply towards my degree and my schoolwork but like I've been so how do I say I've been so deprived and I guess burnt out of always just thinking about school and that video would come up sometime soon I'm just gonna throw it together I'm not done with the painting so I'm going to keep documenting the process until I am done with it so who knows when it's gonna be up but I will tell you that it is a landscape scene I almost wanted to do something abstract but I thought it's been a while since I used oil painting I just want to have fun with it so I pulled up a photo reference from when I went to the cruise last year thank you so much for spending time with me it's been a great few weeks and i will see you very soon in whichever video is going to come up and if you haven't checked out the last one it was when i tried out all of that colorful makeup and there's a giveaway going on in there in case you didn't hear about it for now sending you all my love and talk to you soon bye